But a good thing about Fox in this matchup is that oh, up there is actually a multi-hit. Um, multi -hit, so can't actually just focus through his up air. If he tries to land on top of him, he's probably going to eat a billion up air. So we'll see. Already at 56% though. Yikes. Wow. I, it feels like I just blinked and <laughs> Charlie was at 56%. Oh, yeah, they he tried to land on top. Just have blinked, and that did happen. Charlie having mm. a lot of trouble starting this engine. Yeah, I like what Zapelli uh, does in neutral. He really um, walks a lot in mid range. I think that's really strong with Ryu. But here we go. Fox oh. train. Oh, yeah, Charlie went off stage. That's a bad spot. Whoa. Wow. I Dash attack catching the jump option. Yeah, I haven't seen that before. Oh, wow. down tilt. Going to catch him out of his side B. Yeah, Charlie's going to have to really be careful at the ledge now. One thing I don't know is that uh, Charlie has noticed that whenever Zapelli is low to the ground and um, got him, wow, got to wow. do it. Yeah, whenever Zapelli is low to the ground, he is falling to the stage with focus attack. He never cancels it. If he can recognize that and use that into uh, his advantage, he'll know to respect it and then just punish with the grab. Yeah, or you can just up air him for it. Oh yeah, uh, that's true. If you just see him focusing on top of him, just free up air. Like and that. There's that free up air. Yeah, this guy might not know that Fox is up for his multi hit. He keeps focusing on top of Charlie, but still in a really good spot, honestly. If he just lands like a nice back air right now, up to Shore Yukin is pretty scary. Especially up to Shore Yukin when you have over 118%. Yeah, Rage Ryu is a beast. Normal Ryu is a beast, but especially in Rage. Nice like focus cancel. Evil Ryu. Yeah, I. I I kind of wish that was a skin. <laughs> like I swear, if there's like hacks that have Evil Ryu, please point me in that direction because that that would be awesome. We're seeing some tricky movements. Shine coming out for Charlie, knocking that red fireball back at at Zabelli. Yeah, but he's still not uh, getting this kill. He's just trading with Ryu. Oh, oh man, right into the donkey kick. Rough spot. How's he gonna get off the ledge? Yeah, you can't jump against those tilts. Oh, oh. no, heck. And that's a Good. two stock game yeah. one. Disgusting. That was very good uh, ledge play. It's Char like Charlie doesn't really know that you can't actually jump for free when Ryu's throwing out those tilts at the ledge. Oh, that water ball is KO. <laughs> Shout out to the H2O. Yeah, um, up tilt and down tilt are so strong at the ledge just because they beat jump and neutral get up uh, pretty heavily. And if you get caught the wrong, like with the wrong hit, it can get spiked, you can get sure you. Or you can just straight up fall down and just lead to an easy stage break, as you saw. Yeah. So, yeah, try to go to the don't, And they can also, you know, up for that. Uh, they if they do connect with up tilt into a dare. Yeah. That's something else you got to be worried about, aware of. All right, staple counter pick for Fox main Dreamland. I'm guessing uh, Zapelli might have been Battlefield, and Charlie just opted for Battlefield too. I mean, it's a good choice. Definitely. Fox is amazing on this stage just because he gets these up airs and he's keep going like he is right now. Oh, my wow. God. Charlie playing that's so how you, serious that's right now. That's how you answer back. Charlie only took 10% that stock. I love the charge up smash because he might have just predicted. Oh, pistol combos? Dang, Charlie, calm down. But he uh, he might have just like read that Zep Pelly would want to um, air dodge to the, to the ground because he was getting up air streamed. And, just blew him up with the up smash, and now he's just going on a full-on uh, momentum string here. Wow, the last hit of Dare actually connecting. Didn't even look like he threw out Dare. Yeah, he really only needs the last hit that pops him up, because he can follow up from that. Oh, here we go. Take, up, take him up again. Trying to chase his line with these up airs. The Fox Vortex is so deadly. Chase you with the... Oh! oh! Just like Man. Dynamo, Charlie is in the bottom of the stage. Yeah, Zapelli's not afraid to throw out that uh, that down air. And Charlie's got to be careful because uh, Ryu can kill him really early. Yeah, as early as 60%. It only takes about one one good combo and he'll be at 40. A few hits after that. That shield. That shield. Nair forward air just destroyed half of Charlie's shield. All right, he has him at the ledge. Probably want to go. Oh, oh, he went deep. Look like he was going for a four air spike, possibly. Yeah, I would not challenge Ryu Shoryuken with a with a fair with a fair spike. Shoryuken yeah. comes up too fast and has a pretty good hitbox. Uh oh, got him with that back air. It's just scary for Charlie. He must know at this point that he actually cannot afford to get caught by an up tilt. One good hit, and he's going to be at kill percent. 
Oh, there, there it is. is. Kill percent. Okay, he can't jump from the ledge. Ooh. So Pelly actually could have blown up that side B approach. This is scary. He's a, he's wants to be up at the at the ledge. I think Zapelli recognizes that if he gets yeah, good that shot. if uh, Zapelli was hit with illusion, it would put him in a good position to either get up aired or even back aired. Yeah, but it's bad that illusion from the ledge is because the startup animation just gets beat by up tilt and down tilt, and he'll get destroyed. But luckily, he gets a back air trade, so he's out the last stock. Zapelli definitely, I, I honestly. I honestly thought he had the advantage at the end there. Yeah, I, I, at the you know those last ten seconds of the match, every time Charlie hit on the landed on the ledge, I was expecting Zapelli to crouch down and start you know putting out those those light down tilts. Down tilt. He he was just too uh, down tilt. You know. No, he can do both though. Oh yeah, yeah. But I was, that's what I was expecting from from Zapelli is you know those down tilts, try and beat out Illusion. And then into a Shoryuken, but instead he just stayed in shield. Here we go, though. I do believe this is still a best of three range in this bracket. So, loser at this will be going into that loser's bracket. Is this still quarters? Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Wow. 90 entrance. All right. Shout out to 90 man weeklies. Yeah, Zapelli's out of shield options haven't really been the best so far. We're actually seeing uh, Charlie play a little bit more, not patient, but he's playing smarter. He's definitely not committing as hard whenever he goes and approaches Zapelli. Oh, and he knows something's coming. Oh, oh that's he actually got the jab. last hit. It looked like Zapelli didn't really know how to actually punish that. Oh! Caught the first hit up to in the shore. You can kill him at 93%. No hesitation on that. From the true shore you can from that up till as soon as he heard that connection, he already knew that that buffer was coming. Oh, 15 percent from back air. Oh, this is a bad spot. Oh no. Yeah, he wants to just steal it out with the uh, the stage bike there, but puts himself in a terrible position. Charlie's going to capitalize and instantly bring this right back. Only 17 percent extra credit onto Charlie. That you know that all those back airs really coming in for Charlie, evening up this game. All right. Nice down tilt catch. Oh, miss input. Yeah. Definitely looked like he wanted to go for uh, maybe a Tatsu out of that. But still doing big damage. Reuse aerials are disgustingly strong. Ooh, oh, that yeah, that up smash was uh, not intended. Charlie jumped in his seat. But luckily for him, Zapelli didn't capitalize hard. Ooh, Nair got in. Yeah, Nair. Nair put, combo uh, breaking. Yeah, yeah. Charlie's combo. I mean, Charlie was starting up the vortex. Zapelli was racking up, getting a bunch of damage onto him. If Nair breaking it. Okay. Really close for both players, but Charlie is definitely the one sweating now because he knows he cannot overcommit. It only takes one good tilt into Shoryuken. He died around this percentage last time. Trying to chase his landing. Nice. Nair to catch the air dodge. Up to him right out of the oh. Tatsu. Waste for the air dodge. Up air. 2 1. Charlie the king. Charlie recognized that at that percent. 